Hey, how you guys doing? Um, for this week, we're gonna t uh, take a look in depth with audio syncing problems. Um, often, uh, depending how you route your audio and video together, sometimes people separate their audio through a mixer, rack gear, and then record it. Uh, and then your video and audio get mixed together. Um, sometimes, uh, for, uh, for instance, audio or video normally lags behind audio depending on many issues because video uses a lot more bandwidth than audio. So you often find the video to actually be kind of slow. Um, now, if you route your audio directly into your camera, like I am doing now, it's not usually an issue, but if you route it separately, like I used to do it through a mixer, and also depending on the length of your uh, perhaps um, audio cable or even your video cable, in this case, HDMI cable is extra long in some cases, which may delay the video even more. Um, now I use uh, OBS Studio now, and um, this was another issue which I couldn't even find online uh, or even on YouTube. Uh, they tell you like on YouTube, like how to fix the audio syncing problem in OBS Studio, a lot of YouTubers, but what they don't tell you is if you're viewing it live, uh, without recording the disc or even streaming, it looks like it doesn't work at all. I'm like, well, I put a one second delay. I'm not even seeing it delayed at all. But um, what it is, is unless you record that stream to disc and then watch the pre-recorded video, will you notice the, um, the audio syncing correctly? Or if you're streaming out on the other end, the viewers will see that the audio syncing is fixed. But if you just do it live, you're not going to notice the difference. But it is actually working, but you have to set it up differently. So I'm going to run you through the whole process right now and uh, go from there. For this uh, audio video sync test, we're using Stream Geeks, which I'm going to put um, where you can get that in the comment section. And uh, basically what this does is give you both audio and video. And uh, I'm going to put on the uh, click track so you can hear it for syncing your video and your audio. So what you're going to do is you're going to point your video camera toward the, um, the monitor, uh, mobile device, whatever you're playing it, and record the video in its entirety. Okay, once you open up the um, audio video sync test in your um, video editor of choice, um, you're going to go to the audio section on your timeline and you're simply going to choose, um, put your little um, pointer here just where the audio starts. And uh, you're going to look at the video portion and it shows where um, the audio and video is off by about uh, 136 milliseconds as far as the audio goes and that's where you're gonna, you're gonna have to go to OBS Studio to the um, um, audio sync and you're gonna have to uh, off put it by about 136 milliseconds and it should be uh, synced up perfectly. Okay here we are uh, on the desktop here um, in OBS Studio and um, you go to your main um, microphone input and you're going to click on uh, the gear right here below it and you can see the, the audio bar going up and down so you know that's the uh, the one that's working correctly and then you go to advanced audio properties and this is where you set your audio and video sync in this case I'm uh, using a black magic device and uh, of course during like I said during testing uh, I was showing um, 136 millisecond uh, delay not much so we offset it by um, obviously 136 millisecond audio test one two three four five five four three two one